good evening everybody and welcome welcome to my blind playthrough of Red Dead Redemption 2 I am Kevin the Geek and this is episode 1 of our story as we travel back to the land of cowboys and the old wild west now this game I bought originally probably about five years ago but I I've never actually really played it I've literally had it in summer shelf for pretty much all the time I think I briefly played a tiny tiny amount of it and I think I got distracted and never picked it up again so I know virtually nothing about this game I know virtually nothing about the characters, the story, nothing at all, other than, of course, it's Red Dead Redemption, and it's set in the in the old olden days in the in the Wild West and everything. So this is uh, one of one of my uh, one of my new series that we're going to be playing. Of course, there are a number of other games that I am currently uh, playing and, and streaming. So if you check out my channel and all my playlists, you'll see all of these games that I'm currently working my way through and, and streaming most days so if you want to follow me if you want to follow my story and, and how things are going on then please drop a like on the on the videos drop a comment down below give me your thoughts and your feedback remember to keep everything nice and respectful and remember to click on that subscribe button and click the notification bell so you can see when I go live so you can try and watch with me live as I, as I stream this in full but then you can also watch it back at a time that suits you as well quite looking forward to this because I'm a big fan of the Rockstar games and how they present their games. They're very cinematic, maybe is the right word. They, I think I've played some of the, like, the really early Grand Theft Auto games and like, those games I used to skip a lot of things and not really pay attention. I didn't really know what's going on. So I think in, in this I'm looking to you know really watch things, really learn and tell the stories and know what's going Abigail on. Abigail says he's dying, Dutch. We'll have to stop someplace. Okay. Arthur's out looking. I sent him up ahead. Uh, if we don't stop soon, we'll all be dying. This weather, it's May. I'm just hoping the law got as lost as we did. There. Arthur! Any luck? I found a place where we can get some shelter. Let Davy rest while he... You know... An old man in town. Abandoned. It ain't far. Come on! Come on! Yeah! Okay, so we've got a uh, someone called Dutch and someone called Arthur. Do we play multiple characters in this? Chapter one, Coulter. One actually, let me just see. 
if I can turn the, uh, the subtitles off. Um, ah, there we go. Miss Gaskell, get that fire lit quick. Miss Jones, bring in whatever blankets we have. Mr. Pearson, see what we've got in terms of food. Davy's dead. There was nothing more you could have done. What are we gonna do? We need supplies. Well, first of all, you're gonna stay here, and you were gonna get yourself warm. Now, I sent John and Mike scouting out ahead. Arthur and I, we're gonna ride out, see if we can find one of them. And this? Just for a short bit. And I don't see what other choice we have. Listen. Listen to me, all of you, for a moment. Now, we've had, well, a bad couple of days. I loved Davy, Jenny. Sean, Mac, they may be okay. We don't know. But we lost some folks. Now, if I could throw myself in the ground, in their stead, I'd do it, gladly. But we are going to ride out, and we are going to find some food. Everybody, we're safe now. There ain't nobody following us through a storm like this one. And by the time they get here, well, we're gonna be, we're gonna be long gone. We've been through worse than this before. Mr. Pierce, Miss Grimshaw, I need you to turn this place into a camp. We may be here for a few days. Now, all of you, all of you, Get yourselves warm. Stay strong. Stay with me. We ain't done yet. Come on, Arthur. All right. Wow. We've got some work to do. That's a speech We ain't run into them yet. So they both must have headed down the hill. Sure. Hey, I ain't had time to ask. What really went down back there on that boat? We missed you. That's what happened. Come on. Oh. Hey, you need horses? Oh, yeah. Hey, Mr. Smith, get yourself indoors. You need to rest that hand. I'll live. Get indoors, son. Bye. We need you strong. OK. <sighs> All right, let's head out. Ain't sure what we're gonna find out here, Dutch. We have to try. Stay close. We'll do our best to stick to the trail. This goddamn weather. Been two days or more like this now. Oh, it has to blow over soon. So I take it then this Dutch is the, uh, the leader of the... Uh, the camp. Morgan's the guy we play. Do we maybe careful over this bridge here? Is it maybe a little bit like Grand Theft Auto 5 where you um Hey move up alongside where you play me. multiple characters? You back there. I can't believe we lost Davy too. He's the last one, Arthur. No more. We need to get those people warm and fed. 
least we don't need to worry about Pinkerton's tailing us in this. Uh, a couple more days, we'll be on the other side. Jeez, you massive. need to help me pick the others back up. You're the only one I can rely on to stay strong right now. We got fire and shelter. That's a start. And what about the money? Please tell me you at least got the money before it all went to hell on that boat. We did. It's stashed with the rest of the money in town. It'll be safe for now. But we sure can't go back there to collect it anytime soon. Wait, is that someone coming towards us? Jesus, well, I can't see them. A bad than I have. You up ahead. Who's there? Micah. Gentlemen. Found anything? I think so. Found a little homestead down that way. Okay. Anyone home? Sure. Place is blazing with light and noise. Sounded like a party. Let's go see. Follow me. <clears throat> How's Davy doing? Well, he didn't make it. Nor did little Jenny. That's too bad. Davy was a real fighter. Both of them calendar boys is. Or <laughs> was. Yeah. And Mac, Sean, we don't know why a business. I'm glad you're all right, Micah. Always. Ask him if he's seen John. Hey, have you seen John, Micah? Didn't see much of anything once this storm came in. He hasn't seen him. He'll be fine. Things always turn out right for that boy. I hope Mac and Sean are still out there somewhere, too. Hey, Arthur, let me take the rear. You move up. Passing you. Amazing how they would know where they're going in the middle of like the woods when all you see is hills and snow and everything. Well now the blue one goes. Okay, let's keep it down now, gentlemen. It's just up ahead. Stop and stash those lanterns, boys. Best you two lie low on this. Okay. Let's head down there. <laughs> Open display in the lower left corner. Okay. Down to bar shows you remaining health, the level of the inner here. core, 
in terms of how quickly your health refills. Let me do the talking. We don't want to scare these folks. Pretty much up to knees in the snow. Someone's having fun in there. You too. Get yourself out of sight. One Love how it, it keeps the uh, the footprints in the snow. A lot of games they like disappear after a few way. seconds. Arthur, you take that old shed on the left and stay low, both of you. Take your shed and then stay cover. Arthur, what are you doing? I said get out of sight. I am doing. Keep your horses on. and I, well, we got into some trouble up the way, lost in the storm. Ah, gentlemen. We can't help you, mister. I got folks, Arthur, dying on the Arthur, we got a problem. <laughs> folks, there's a corpse right here. Now, oh. I just Arthur, some there's a body food in the wagon. Ah, I hear you. Just gentlemen. keep your eyes on Dutch. Please. I think you should go now, buddy. Okay, so we've got a knife, a fist, or a cataman re revolver. Now, friend, I ain't asking for much. Please, I am kind of... Slow revolving. Running the snow. There we go. I can't believe he can run so fast in the snow. Didn't seem to be going too well. Goddamn O'Driscoll boys here. Why? I don't know. Micah, go bring the horses closer to the house. Arthur, let's go search the cabin. Smells like a party in here. Turn the place upside down. Uh, I Grab as many supplies as you can. We need the essentials. Food, medicine, whiskey. Whiskey, that'll be good. Odysseus, I don't believe it. It's a strange one, all right. Maybe they're hiding up here, too. There's a big price on Colm O'Driscoll's head. Nearly as big as the one on yours. One calm dead is about the only thing me and Uncle Sam agree on. Oh, I'm starving. Oh. You should eat something now. Get your strength up for the ride back. Easy provision to restore some health core. Okay. Uh, what do I fancy? Some sweet corn, some baked beans, or some peaches. Hey, what? I ain't eating baked beans cold. I'm sorry. So let's have some peaches. That'll do. The place is dry, warm. We've got some biscuits. We could maybe move the women and Jack down here. Maybe. We'll see how they are when we get back. I don't really want. 
want us to split up? Cool. Inspect some blood. Big old pool of blood on the floor here. I saw. Probably the poor bastard who lived here. Mike have found a dead body in the wagon outside. Keep searching while I pack these on the horses. Some health skills. Like a bit of health cure. Grab anything you think we can use, I am doing Dutch. Oh. Didn't realize there was a ladder there. He walked into it. Some oat cakes. Some ammo. That is very good. I like a bit of ammo. You don't really want to be caught with your pants down, do you? Oh. I'm apparently crouching. How do I stand Ah, there we go. How do, how do I stand up? Hmm. Poor bastard was married to. Uh, was that the guy who was, who was outside? Jake and Sadie wedding, September 7th, 1896. Wow. Oh, some oat cakes again. Anything else? It doesn't look like it. Anything on the table? Oops. Some salted meat. Come on, Arthur. Get a move on. I am doing. Still looking, Dutch. This is. Aha, I was about to say, this is a chest. A queen purse. One dollar sixty-four. Well, hey. I wonder what the currency is like in in this game. Jewelry. Some premium cigarettes. Not just any old cigarettes. Some premium cigarettes. Millicent cigarettes. Oh. Anything down there? Nope, I think that is everything. I'd like to say Nick, it's a bit warm. Uh is there any way of getting up there? Uh I don't know, like it. Okay. Let's go back outside into the snow. Micah, Arthur, keep looking for stuff. Arthur, go see if there's anything in that barn. Micah, in you search the cabin and see what we missed. Sure. Uh, I have a hair. Left, right, left, right, left, right, Get uppercut. Up. There we go. Oh. Sneaky little bastard. Should I kill him? No. Not yet. Find out what they're doing here. Yeah, what are you doing here? Home is. Oh, this son of a bitch will talk. Oh. Where's Como Driscoll? Who's Como Driscoll? With the others. 
at an old mining camp southwest of here, near the lake. Mining camp near the lake. What are you bastards doing? Why are you up here? Uh, we're fixing to rob some train. Gonna blow the tracks. I don't know Loving more than train. that, I swear. <laughs> well, I would say it looks like you have this, Arthur. Do what you want with him. I don't care. But bring mm. that horse when you're done. Oh, we got a horse over there. I don't know anything else. All right, are we going to be a good guy or are we going to? Please spare me. Get the hell out of here. Go. Pick up your gun. Where's my gun? Oh, is that it? Flashing over there. Pick up my hat. Hey, yeah, can't lose me hat. How do you know I'm a cowboy if, if I don't have a don't have a hat? Yeah, okay. Easy, it's okay. There we go. There's a good boy. Not that I can go anywhere near him. If, if this were me in that situation, I'd literally be holding my breath. I'm, I've, I've got allergies. I'm, I'm allergic to horses. Literally, my head would be twice the size. My hat wouldn't fit me anymore. You let him go, huh? It's all the little bastards covering off. Yeah. Figured he won't get far in this anyway. That looks like a decent horse. You should keep him. You need to hitch him. He's already skittish. Oh! Micah, what the hell do you think you're doing? Hold still, the wild thing ate you! Whoa! Who's this? I wasn't doing nothing. She's one of them O'Driscoll's. No, she ain't, Micah. Look at her. Miss, miss. Are you... Oh! Micah, look at her. Miss, now, it is going to be okay. We mean you no harm. Miss, miss. Come on, it'll be okay. We need to get out of here and Oh, quick. is she the, um, uh, is she the wife? Uh, what was it, Sadie? Oh. 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 You okay, miss? They came three days ago. Then my husband, they... Okay, miss, you are safe now. And you can't stay here. Come with us. Arthur. Yes. It's okay. Uh, we're bad men. We ain't them. So, uh, it's okay. Uh, get on. Uh, we'll keep you safe until you figure out what you want to do. What's your name, miss? Wow. Miss. Adler. Adler. Miss Adler. Sadie Adler. Sadie Adler. Well. Mrs. I, he. He was my husband. That, that must be so awful. You, you're leaving what must be your, your family home behind. You, you know, your, your husband's been murdered. For, for probably for what? You know, for hey, no reason for me. Somebody's coming! Looks like it's Dutch. Hey, everybody, Dutch is back. How'd you get on? Uh, Micah found a homestead, but he weren't the first. Colm O'Driscoll and his scum, they beat us to it. Uh, uh, we found some of them there. But there is more about, apparently. Yeah, Scott apparently want to rob a train. Thank you. That's the last thing we need right now, Dutch. Well, it is what it is. But we found some supplies, some blankets, a little bit of food, and this poor soul, Mrs. Adler, Miss Tilly, Miss Karen, would you warm her up, give her a drink or something? And Mrs. Adler, it's going to be okay. You're safe now. They turned her into a widow. Animals. I need some rest. I haven't slept in three days. 
Ooh. You're over here. Miss O'Shea will show you the way. Mr. Morgan, we put you in a room over here. Thank you, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Bell, you're with the Bell is over there. Morgan. Arthur Morgan, right. Well, how come Arthur gets a room and I get a bunk bed next to Bill Williamson and a bunch of darkies? Get yourself to bed. Wow. I mean, that's all. Oh, blimey, that, that was suddenly very bright. Enter. Pursued by a memory. He ain't been seen in days. Weather ain't let up. He's strong. And he's smart. Strong, at least. <gasps> Hello, Arthur. Abigail. Arthur, how you doing? Just fine, Abigail. And you? I need you to... I I'm sorry. I'm sorry to ask, but... It's little John. He's got himself caught into a scrape again. He ain't been seen in two... Two days. Your John will be fine. I mean, he may be as dumb as rocks and as dull as rusted iron, but that ain't changing because he got caught in some snowstorm. Please go take a look. Javier? Yes. Javier, will you ride out with Arthur <clears throat> to take a look for John? <clears throat> You're the two best fit men we've got. Now? She's... We're all... Yeah, we're oh. pretty worried about him. I know. The situation were reversed. And he looked for me. Thank you. <sighs> This way. Last I know, John was headed up the river. For all we know, he kept riding north and never looked back. He wouldn't leave. Not like that. Uh, wouldn't be the first time. My initial thought is it's a very smooth transition between like these cut scenes and, and then you kind of taking control and and and, and playing the game it is you can tell i mean kudos to the art directors and, and the people hey, I see some smoke. they've really Come put on, a lot of effort into more of how the whole world well, looks it seems somebody left Recently. And that way. Sure, well, come on then. There's some tracks leading to the river. Ha! Oh. Let's cross. See, they continue up that way. You think it's John? You tell me. Ah, so the whole These are horse tracks for sure, but help as well. Could That's be interesting. Let's just see where they lead. So you were there, Javier. Oh my what God! What really happened see. on that boat? We had the wow. money. It seemed fine. Then suddenly they were everywhere. Bounty hunters? No, Pinkerton. It was crazy. Raining bullets. Also, not gallop when it's coming his empty. Slowing down would allow your horse to get oh. Take it slow. Big ravine here. Dutch killed a girl in a bad way. But it was a bad situation. I ain't like him, though. We <laughs> continue along the cliff wall here. <laughs> Baby got shot. Mac and John. Both shot too. Sean, we don't even know. I'm surprised we escaped at all. Don't want to By the pull time down you there. boys showed up from the other side of town, we were only just holding on. Bad business, all right. Wow. And snow's coming in hard again. We'll lose these tracks if we don't move fast. Oh, that's well, do the cinematic camera talk. Ah, wow. This is nice. Uh -huh. 
Because I mean, like you're actually in a movie. Feels like it's really easy to fall and probably die. Horse struggle. Yeah. Lot of fresh snow here. I don't know. Are you done? Are you die? Best hobby ever. We can't follow nothing. Let's push on a little bit. Maybe we'll pick up the trail again. Ten years. As far as I can see, man, you do anything. Look at that, see that? I don't know what he's supposed to be looking at. John was riding that horse when we left Blackwater. Oh. Let's see if he can hear us. Oh. There's some voice. Come on. Up there. What's, what's killed the horse? I mean, there's obviously blood. It's coming from up ahead somewhere. I don't think we can go much further on the horses. We'll have to walk from here. I grab that shotgun from your horse. Oh, who knows what's up ahead? Can you carry one side arm at a time? You just want to carry weapons with the weapons on your horse. Okay. Grab your shotgun. I'm thinking if, if, if there's a... The horse is all bloodied. You sure about this? Either the bloke has had to kill him try to get some meat. To it's coming from this way. Do something. Okay. He's trying to survive. It's slippery, be careful. Or, know, so some wild animals out here, like... Yeah, that we're high up here. Bears and You're wolves, telling me. Something like that. I hear about there's loads of animals and stuff like that out uh, in this game that you have to hunt and stuff. Watch yourself. Watch out here. It's a very slow moving game, but... Watch your head here. Oh. Let's pass. There we go. Okay. Good now. Watch your step. This is real slippery. Stay close Stand to the, the wall. Sound of the is empty. Your movement speed will be limited. Okay. Up this way. Um. Now. Yeah, right, look at it here, yeah. We're coming, John! John, who's John? Oh, well, I mean, this is a bloke. <laughs> Damn, it's cold. Keep moving then. Come on. God! Horst! John, can you hear me? Come here! Can you see him in the That's 
John. We're Bye. coming. Spell there. He's down here. Down here. All right. Hot down, Marston. Ah, there he is. That's quite a scratch you got there. Ooh. Never thought I'd say this, but good to see you, Arthur Morgan. Believe me, I've had to Same as the horse. You don't look so good. I don't feel too good, neither. I'm freezing. Wow. Hey, he ain't even got a fire. How is he survive? Not just yet, cowboy. Come on, compadre. Well, we can't go back the way we came. Let's try this way. Ain't you a sorry sight? Can't argue with you there. See, I told Dutch you weren't the right man for this. I'm sure you did. This is coming to You all right? I think so. Come on. Hopefully this will lead us out. Oh, speaking of the devil, wolves. Three of them. I'll distract them while you get to the horse. Go, draw them off. Okay, here we go, John. We'll leave them to Arthur. Uh, where are they? Ah, there they are. I have a feeling it's not over. I, feel, oh, I don't know why. Good. I've got a feeling there's going to be You'll more be of them. Fine. It's just like a, a dog bite. Uh, knew a fella. Got bit by a dog. Died an hour later. You ain't going to die. Not yet. Can't see him. Down off this 
course. Can we get some help here? Hey, Arthur and Javier back. Need some help here. Come on, help him down. You're alive. You're alive. Come on, here we go. I mean, maybe there we should have go. skinned ah, the wolf and maybe it's his leg. Help the camp. Come on, you know? let's get you warm. Thank you, thank you both. This is a new low, even by your standards. <laughs> thank you, Arthur. Thank you. You got any other lost maidens need saving? <laughs> Not today. Have you and Dutch talked about how we're gonna get out of this? I was just discussing with Herr Strauss when the weather breaks. I suppose we'll have to keep heading east. East? Into all that? That's civilization. I know. The West is where our problems are worse. Come on, Herr Strauss, let's get warm. Thank you, Mr. Moggy. <sighs> so I guess this is something that we're going to learn about this. I don't know, they, they talk about some stuff that's. We've been I'm running guessing for weeks. Sorry. We found happen. shelter and. Been resting here in some old abandoned mining town while we wait the thaw. Hardly the spring I had been hoping for. So what now, Dutch? Yes, I'm guessing this is like we get, um, we get warm. Some some story. Was it maybe in the first Red Dead game, which I, I I never really played that as well. I mean, again, here. now I've played kind of like a warm couple enough. of. A couple of levels, yes. and I remember doing some, and, and I think I stopped when I, I played some black capital in car game or something. Doubtful, just worried. You have been shot at before, Jose. I don't feel that this is honestly anything new. I hope not. We had a bit of bad luck, but then the storm covered our tracks, so now we wait a bit, and we go back to Blackwater, and we get our money, or we get some more mm. money, and we keep heading. West. But we're heading east. For now. For now. We got this. We're safe. Stay strong, Jose. What about you, Arthur? You doubt me too? Never. Good. Because you know me, son. I'm just getting started. Once we get some money, well, they... They better send some good men after us, because they ain't never gonna find us. But we need money. Of course, Dutch. Thank you, son, for your strength. It means a lot to me. Okay. I think Dutch could do with uh, letting his beard grow out, you know, while, while, it's, uh, while it's cold. I mean, I don't, don't, don't know what he's like, but I mean, I always find in the winter, Having a bit of a beard just protects your face out a little bit, especially in the in the, uh, in the cold. And that means it's like home base or, or you know, something like that. And then we've got like a B and a P. So are these sort of like missions or something? Sort of like detail a bit? Let's have a look. Do this. Oh, we've got to get inside. Ah, oh, must be inside. Help oh, with you boys because I thought you liked action. A couple of days on the lamb and you lot have all turned yellow. Apart from you, of course. Shut up, Micah. I ain't never seen so many long faces. Mm. I guess... I guess folks miss them. That fell. But when I fall, I don't want no fuss. When you fall, there'll be a party. <laughs> a party? <laughs> Probably. Uh -huh. Funny, huh? Sure. <laughs> Oh. I don't feel like being laughed at by the likes of you two. Stop it! Now! You fools punching each other when Como Driscoll's needing punching hard. You want to sit around waiting for him to come find us? All of you, we got work to do. 
Come on. You sure about this, Dutch? Yes. Both been through a lot recently. We hardly back on our feet yet. And the last thing we need is to get bushwhacked by Colm O'Driscoll. Let's go. I know you hate him, Dutch. He's here for us. I doubt that. No, nope, you're just doubting me. I would never doubt you, Dutch. You... You always said revenge is a luxury we can't afford. This is the right call, Arthur. Take this. And this is about more than revenge for business long ago. They were talking about trains and detonators here. Cole always had good information. Come on. And you think now is the right time to hit a train? Now you might fancy living on deer piss and rabbit shit. I'm getting too old for that life. Mr. Ooh. Matthews, Mr. Smith, Mr. Pearson. Would you please look after the place? There are O'Driscoll's about. Yeah. So they're very respectful in this camp, aren't they? Southwest, right, Arthur? Yeah. yeah calling everyone like Mr. Smith, Mr. Southwest. Bob, Mr. Brown, whatever. They're camped near some lake. Okay, let's go find these bastards before they find us and rob this for their planet. There's quite a few of them. As far as I can tell, the only fools out here are us and them. They must be this way. So who are these O'Driscolls you that good, they Dutch? keep mentioning? Of course. Listen, I know you don't think much of my ideas recently, but this is the right move. Okay. You know I got your back. I learned a long time ago that you hit Como Driscoll. Wait I wonder if these him. are just because of sort of like the um... This feud oh, between you and him needs to be I remember the, the name of them, but they're, they're from GK5, the, 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 the ones that Trevor was getting, getting to beef with. Some things I can forgive, others I can't forgive. they maybe like Beast Descendants if this well, is like the same Annabelle. world? Just hundreds of years earlier, probably like 100, 100 years. You killed his brother, Dutch. Yes, I did. And I hope the bastards will be reunited soon enough. That's right. how this will end. Damn right, boss. <laughs> see yeah, that so smoke? Let's it's cut nice to see how very respectful they are. Even though they're lake, maybe so outlaws and, and uh, robbers and, and you know, they want to steal from people and things, they're, they're very respectful <laughs> outlaws. gentlemen this is it are we goddamn ready ready, ready Dutch we're ready for what I don't really now, know what we're doing <laughs> mr. Morgan and I we're gonna head up here a little okay. see if we can't get a sense of the layout of the camp mr. Williamson mr. Bell you two take up a hidden position just outside the camp mr. Summers mr. Escuela you two hold position here Let's go. We're getting off, are we? And, um, hang hey, on. We got this covered, Arthur. Go with Dutch. I'm trying to remember what, what you do. I don't have to get the guns off there. Anyway. 
There they are. That's definitely them. Home? I think so. Yeah, that's him. The environment looks beautiful. Yes, you're right. Who's he talking to? He don't seem very happy. No. They leaving? Seem to be. Should we go get them? No. Cone can wait. Best to get some of them out of there. And much less fun to rob him and his score if he never finds out about it. <laughs> Come on, let's get down there. Okay. Don't forget to grab that rifle from your horse. Well, that's what I was trying to do before. Weapons are not setting you load out before you dismounting two, will get remain up there on your and horse. You keep us covered. You got it, Dutch. Okay. Hang on. Which one was my horse? Um. Ah, that was my horse. Select a long arm slot. Um, Quick, grab that repeater and let's get moving. Good. Okay. Come on, let's go. Seems easiest to take the same path down as Bill and Micah. Like you said, revenge is a luxury we can't afford. Yeah, just wasn't sure you agreed with me. Arthur, Arthur, have you completely lost faith in me? Our needs right now are supplies, equipment, and a way out of here. Everything else, including Calm, can wait. Okay. There's enough of those bastards down there to deal with as it is. Now, come on. I wonder how long it's going to be before I get shot and die. Huh? Sorry, am I in your way, Dutch? I'm very sorry. There you go. You go on ahead. Why don't you go on? I think that the slow nature of this game really means that you can really appreciate everything. Um, the problem with, with like Grand Theft Auto, which, don't get me wrong, I bloody love here. that game. Careful. You know, it, it's very easy to miss so much stuff because you're driving around in really fast cars a lot of time and everything. Especially when you're doing it online, you've got all these flying bikes everything these days. Whereas this, you know, you sort of a chance to appreciate the beauty. Someone was talking about hitting someone, sounds like. Maybe I should take the lead on this. They're going to be gunning for you. They ain't got me yet. No. But the way our luck's been running, hush. Let's just get down there first. Follow me. Let's head for that building in front. Hey, anybody see me? I think he went hunting with the others. Well, I'm a bitch is meant to be on guard duty. Someone apparently called Liam is supposed to be on guard duty. So apparently went hunting instead. One problem with uh, with doing anything in the snow is if, you, if you're trying to be sneaky, you're giving Stay away low. your position pretty much straight away, aren't you? Oop. Come on, follow me. Oh, 
Is that someone? Is that one of ours? Okay, let's get oh, it's one of ours. So, what are we doing, Dutch? I can take this if you want. Just make the call. You want to take the lead? Go. Okay, I'll go first. So I they let you go? I wouldn't have done. Tell him they have much choice in just picking his teeth off the floor. Yeah, and you didn't tell him nothing. Not a word. Are you going? Oh, headshots! You're dead, you sons of bitches! Really bad shooter in real life. I can't even see where they are. Ah, there they are. Hold why near loot to, to loot it. Okay, we've got some snake oil apparently. Some chewing tobacco. Anything here? I imagine Colm doesn't even know half the names of these fools. Ah! You're dead, 
Woo! Get to the camp. We'll get what we need. Clear out. Now give me all your stuff. I love that it gives you like the marks of where the dead bodies are. It, uh, I mean, particularly in the, in the snow, makes it very easy to know, you know, where where to find people to loot. Have a very full satchel, I think. By the oh, I've got a silver ring. Nice. A miracle tonic. Uh, lots of uh, dead body loots, uh, uh, like gun. Uh, well, I say gun uh, cartridges. We don't have time to mess around. There we do. Oops. We're waiting on you, Arthur. Yeah, well, I I want to get. Uh, all the stuff for the camp. I'm sorry if it bothers you, Dutch, but I'm trying to do a good thing. Arthur, get over here. I'm doing. I mean, you can talk to me while you're doing, while, while I'm looting. Ooh, some open gin. I like a bit of gin. I don't think I'm going to get everybody because I'm... Oh, gold, what do you mean? There's so many of them. I could be here all day, I think, if, if, uh, if I wanted to, to get all this stuff. Oh, there he is. Is this... These are crystals. Are they like one big old family or something? Because there's a freaking shit ton of them, and they all seem to be called O'Driscoll. Nope, nothing in it. Ooh. Another one here. Oh no, where are we going? Oh, I think that might do. Oh, now we've got a couple more around here. Good work, boys. Now, let's tear this place apart. Bill, you go search that wagon there. Michael, search that building. Arthur, you take that building to the left. Okay. All right, man, quick. Find those detonators, explosives, anything you can. Let's go. I can't carry any more this time. Right, so, so, so I think it basically you can only carry a certain amount of an item for, and I'm guessing what, maybe you sell them or you drink them or you, yeah, 
can't carry any more cigars. Oh, hey! Dynamite! Here. This looks good. What do you think, Bill? Well, looks fine. <laughs> Smells good. Come on. Did we get everything? Think so, boss. Found this on one of them. Thank you. This is perfect. Oh, yeah. Interesting. This is something about the train they was gonna rob. A Mr. Leviticus Cornwall. Mount back up. Let's keep moving. Leviticus Cornwall. Wow. All right. What a name. Let's get out of here. Proud of you boys. All of you. Oh. Man down. Good work, fellas. Not bad for some starving down and outs. They can pummel us hard as they like. But we will always get back up and fight. That's who we are. Outlaws for life, fellas. But respectable we outlaws. John, Mac, Charles, and Sean back riding with us. And I believe, I know, they will all be back. Well, you didn't get combed, but this hit'll hurt him a lot more than any bullet in the head. Especially when we rob this train, too. <laughs> yeah, I guess we'll see about that. Oh, indeed we will. So is no, robbing a train like doing a heist in, in Grand Theft Auto V? Oh, of course he will, just like all the rest. But we're gonna stay a step ahead of them. Make sure we always know where they are before they know where we are. We allowed ourselves to get a step behind in Blackwater. That won't happen again. So I want to know what, 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 what this was that happened in Blackwater, whatever it was. All right, dig in, fellas. Let's make some ground. Yeah. Ground, cowboy. Apologise to any Americans that maybe have been uh, slightly offended there by my very poor imitation there. <laughs> hey, you see that fella? Wasn't he at the camp with Colm? <laughs> Leave him to me. All right, we're heading back. Just bring him back alive. He could be useful. Okay, oh. you got it. Get him alive. Chase down and lasso your oh, just Okay. Oh. Oh, I'm getting stuck. Aha. Uh -huh. Come on. Here. Now, come on. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> come on, boy. Come on, girl. I don't know. A boy, girl, I don't know. <laughs> See what he's got on him. So, what I'm no got? use to you, really. Are you not? Whoa. Do you not mind if I kill you then? Oh, God, no. How type people can be found on the back of the horse? Cool. Okay. What's your name, boy? I don't I'm sure know. Sure, Richard, we're quite the same. Don't know your name. Radar. It's Kieran. Kieran what? Duffy, Kieran Duffy. Well, I ain't gonna lie to you. This is a real bad day for you, Kieran Duffy. Where are you taking me? Somewhere you ain't gonna like. Why? What are you gonna do to me? Some fan you ain't gonna like. So I'd advise you to save your breath for screaming. No, please! Mm. I'll tell you what. If you don't save your breath, you keep running your mouth, 
I might just cut off your damn tongue. Please, mister. Mr. Karen Duffy. I'm not Duffy, used to you. you. You better shut your mouth, you little shitter. I will shut it for you. I will break every bone in your body. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Not one Don't you more damn mess with me. Damn word. Am I clear? Okay. Okay. That's two bones right there. The environment looks beautiful. It does look beautiful. Is that repeat of the same comment from before? I only see one comment. Maybe that, that was a repeated one. Unless someone else has, has happened to have said the exact same uh, comments as before. <laughs> Four spawning increased. Level two. Nice. Stamina increased to level five. Nice. How far are we from the way from the town? Oh, it looks like we might be here. Hey, there we are. Here we are, you sack of shit. Let's introduce you to the boys. Alright, so if I, if I hit source, I presume that means it's not going to like, wander off or anything like that. Don't hurt me, please. Oh, don't worry. They're real nice. Huh. You found a little shit, did you? Yep. Yeah, we did. I got him. Very good. Welcome to your new home. Hope you're real happy here. <sighs> you want me to make him talk? Oh, no. Now all we'll get is lies. Uncle, Mr. Williamson, tie this maggot up someplace safe. We get him hungry first. I got a saying, my friend. We shoot fellas as need shooting, save fellas as need saving, and feed them as need feeding. We are gonna find out what you need. Oh. I can't believe it! An O'Driscoll in my camp! No, I ain't an O'Driscoll, mister! I, I hate that fella! Oh, whatever you say, son. Well done, Arthur. I'm just sorry we missed out on Cole. Oh, there's time enough for that. Now, I gotta figure out if we can hit that train. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, get by the fire, Arthur. I think you're getting a little bit cold, mate. Mission complete, old friends. Perfect. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I think we are going to uh, stop it about here for tonight. Let me just save the game. There we go. Okay, so um, we have met Arthur, who at the moment seems to be our protagonist, who we're you know do, doing most of the stuff with. Maybe we'll play as other characters. I don't know. We'll, we'll uh, obviously see that um, a little bit later. 
Um, we've met um, Dutch, who seems to be the leader of the camp, and you know he seems. I like him. I really like him. Like some of these ones, they can come off very wooden, or sometimes you get a character that seems very. I'm not sure what the what the right word is. Um, yeah, they're, 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 they're sort of they're either too over the top or, or too much. At the moment, I've got just about enough of a sense of him that is a very respectable guy. Yeah, he really loves his friends. Is he treats all of them like his uh, like his family. Um, and like, he would only kill someone if he needs to kill him. Um, but if he sees someone doing doing wrong, he's gonna do something about it. If he sees someone doing something right, he's gonna praise them for it and everything. So yeah, so far, I'm liking what I'm seeing. It's a very slow moving game, but I quite like that. You know, it gives you a lot of chance. Like 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 we said, the 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 environment and the uh, surroundings looks gorgeous. Um, obviously, very snowy at the moment. I've seen a lot of screenshots of, of this game and little clips of videos that um, it's like like not snowing. Basically, it's more spring, summer, whatever. So those will, it will be a very different thing. So we'll, we'll see what they're like. Um, you yeah, know, maybe in the next episode, maybe in a couple of episodes. I don't, I don't know. It depends how long we're in this cold cold winter uh but for now that is going to do it for this evening thank you very much for joining me with episode one of our uh, red dead redemption 2 blind playthrough um and i'm looking forward to continuing this game from everything that people have told me it's quite a long game so we'll see uh, how how many episodes we end up doing this hopefully we'll complete the whole game um but for now that's going to do it um remember to subscribe to the channel you can see all of the games that we're playing uh currently we've got a formula one um series going on we've got a broken sword series going on um my very 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 first video was a uh was a game called 12 minutes and literally i've only done one episode of that but i need to uh do another episode of that so maybe look at maybe do that tomorrow or day after um so i thank you very much for joining me remember like comment share subscribe everything you can and i look forward to seeing you next time take care everybody goodbye